Carlos the third is finally in the gold keys in rise of kingdoms yes the brand new Egyptian commander is finally obtainable outside the event and today we're gonna see how many sculptures of him we can get with over 550 gold keys what's going on guys cheers I literally just woke up like 30 minutes ago this coffee is so good all right so if you guys didn't know there was a brand new update last night that released a bunch of new features and new events for the summertime here in rise of kingdom so if you just started playing because of the Egypt civilization well great news there's a lot new fun stuff on the way but today I want to go over the major change and that is introducing a new way to getting Thutmose the third now as you can see here his origin has been changed before it just said event in universals now we can get him from the expedition metal store and the golden or the gold keys in the tavern now this says he will occasionally be available in the metal store which means that unfortunately Utmos will not be replacing Ethelflaed here in the metal store which is a huge disappointment my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined what that means is that just like this Charles Martel sculpture that I was lucky enough to get last night, uh, he will randomly show up in these refresh chances, and that's a huge bummer. Guys, the most the third, from my opinion, is a very cool looking commander. He is a very well-rounded commander for the early game. I don't know if he's going to be insanely good in the late game or how that's going to work. But again, for the early game, I think that there's an opportunity here to give new players and free to play players a very solid commander that they can work from, especially one that would pair well with Isongye in the early game. Uh, and there was there was an opportunity here for him to go in that Ethel fled slot in the metal store. And yet again, he was just thrown in gold keys. And the problem with that is that virtually nobody is going to use Thutmose. That's literally the, the reality they went through all of this effort to design this commander to design all the skills and balance him out and all that stuff and people just aren't going to use him for new players this isn't going to feel much different because you, you don't have basically any of the commanders in the gold keys uh, but this further dilutes the pool which is definitely unfortunate but that is not why we're making this video okay we're making this video to see how many of him can we actually get with 550 over 550 golden keys now i do want to point out there is a new way or i should say uh, the return of an old way to sort your commanders and finally we can sort them by power once again i absolutely love this feature um most often you know i love again i do love that you can sort by different filters at this point i think this is very useful especially for me as a youtuber but when i'm not looking to sort anything i want to see my most powerful and most used commanders first front and center and that is the way that we've got this set up and i'm very happy about it now before we go ahead and open those gold keys i do want to note that you can also purchase Thutmos the third from the daily special offer and I will advise you for most players this is absolutely not the commander that you should be getting from this daily special offer and now that depends you know as a gold key commander he may show up here relatively early throughout your journey in rise of kingdoms and if you have him to choose from from gold key commanders I would say that he's probably one of the better ones but of course YSG is absolutely a far superior option than Thutmose because he's going to just be relevant for such a long time and then of course if you end up with Alexander and and those types of commanders it's just I mean now we have Saladin and Attila Takeda Guan Leo and I know that these unlock over time and they're not all not unlocked all at the same time so in the early game you may have access to Thutmose whereas other commanders you don't so I understand that but from for the most part this is not a commander you should be buying from the daily special offer unless you're a well now I guess the last thing I want to talk about before we open the gold keys is that Thutmose does now have a relic which is actually very exciting this is the I don't know what that's called but we're gonna call it the scarab this is probably a goal it's probably gold if you unlock it and I think this is a very solid relic I mean it gives a very solid well-rounded commander uh 30 percent more stats which is just a vanilla plain and simple way to make him better and on top of that it's 15 percent archer health and health is a very good stat for any troop type especially archers uh and i love this combination here perhaps it would have been better if they did archer defense and archer health that could have been very nice to see uh, but the thing about the attack is that the attack is going to let him deal more damage the health is going to give him slightly better trades so i think that that's a i think this is a very solid relic for the most to have however despite the amount of coins i have up here i'm not going to be unlocking this because again 
be because he was putting the gold keys i'm never gonna have enough sculptures to actually use the most the third so there's no point in me wasting my ex uh, exhibit coins on unlocking a relic even if it is a very solid relic um it's probably the best relic that i have access to right now because i've already unlocked all the ones that i care about um but again there's just no point in me buying it because it's just gonna take so long to get the most to a point where i can use him that i just never will i mean they just put Boudica in the game right with henry the fifth i mean there's just like all my sculptures are gonna go here right that's it just it makes more sense to do that she's just far and away better than the most the third even with the relic so again that's why i feel like putting them in gold keys for old players just basically is a way of saying like hey you're you're not gonna ever use him don't worry about it oh what happened to my egypt thing up here we gotta there we go okay that's much better that's more appropriate for the video sorry about that guys okay now we're gonna be opening the gold keys here and what i want you guys to notice is also my emotep right i actually have no skills unlocked for him or at least invested in at all i have seven sculptures i got these from i think the event when he came out and he i got a couple of him in silver keys i believe but other than that i haven't invested any universal epic sculptures into him so this is going to give you guys an idea if you're a new player into the game how many sculptures are you going to need to not only maybe expertise emotep but also how many can you get for the most third now we have 554 gold keys i'm gonna go ahead and buy one in the vip shop just to make it 555 just so just for the YouTube uh title and thumbnail that's that's pretty much it don't ever do that don't ever spend your gems on on gold keys it's an absolute ripoff now here's what we're gonna do we're gonna open 55 gold keys just straight up singles and then we'll do all 500 all at once does that sound like a good plan I think that's a great strategy let's go ahead and do it let's open our first gold key are we gonna get any Egyptian commanders that's what we're looking for here we're looking for the Egyptian commanders because those are the ones that's not what I said bro that's not what I meant I know I said it but I didn't mean it you know what I meant what the f Lilith what are you doing what are you doing I literally maxed her years ago man come on dude I didn't mean Egypt like as in Cleo I meant Egypt as in the new ones bro what are you talking I'm three keys in and you're gonna give me a full summon of a legendary it's gonna be the worst legendary you could give me a free summon of what are you doing brother oh my god okay okay well at least we know they're listening there's Imhotep okay so we're popping off now all right we're good we're Gucci just so we're clear I have zero sculptures of Thutmose by the way all right so any sculptures I get that's the total we're gonna get so there's there's a we had seven of, of Imhotep so we got five there which is sick we got a little bit of Sunduk we don't really care about her we don't care about Tamo why do wh here's a here's a real question okay how come I can't turn off those little animations for the for the blue and green commanders can't i do that like why can't we have one of these checkbox things here where it's just like commander summon animation and you could just like turn it off for whatever ones you don't care about that's what i would do i honestly don't care about anything but legendary just a little just a little suggestion there lilith okay i know you got a lot going on but i, I would love to see that i'm tired of i'm tired of tomo popping up okay or gaius marius who cares about gaius marius it's 2022 i haven't cared about guy i forgot he was in, even in the game okay anyway we're popping we're popping these gold keys we're we're, we're flying through. look at it there she is again no one cares to mow go home okay we're not playing with you today all right that sounded weird never mind I just meant like okay Cleo bro what do you mean what do you mean Cleopatra I have 400 of her what does it look like I need more Cleopatra there he is boys Gaius we don't care about Gaius okay Gaius get just go home all right we're not we're not interested all right we're getting the gold stars there he is boys our first two sculpture drop of the most third I want you guys to comment down below how many sculptures of the most do you think I'm going to get in the 555 gold keys that we're opening here today I would love to hear from you guys I want to know what you think I think I'm going to get like maybe I'm going to get trolled I'm going to get like 25 that's what I think honestly we get three more there's some Ragnar that's fine I'll take sculptures bro what Lilith is this some sort of sick game what have I done to you okay all I've ever done is make I just make videos man it's it's good for the game if people are talking about it on YouTube right why do you hate me okay I could you, this could have been two Thutmo summons that's what this could have been and yet here we've got now we've got 410 Cleopatra like is that really come on man I, I get she, that she's got the tig old biddies but like I maxed her a long time ago you know what I'm saying Fucking degenerate okay let's go ahead we're gonna keep we're gonna keep popping we're gonna keep popping off here okay um honestly I don't know what's gotten into Lilith today I'm gonna go ahead and take a sip of my coffee mmm 
now that's a big boy that's a thick boy right there we love to see Ragnar he's not great okay he's not great but I want him for the memes okay Ragnar is sick we love the the Mehmed okay I actually would be more happy to get Mehmed in this video than Thutmose the third okay because Mehmed if you guys didn't know you can use Mehmed in season of conquest behind CPO and he pops off boys he pops off okay very good commander uh probably uh the second best gold key commander in the game if not the best depending on who you're talking to okay I know most people think Charles Martel is and I think he probably still is to be honest with you there he is speak of the devil I don't need more of him either so hey it is what it is there's Imhotep okay our boy shows up once again did I skip some of him I think I've oh we got Mulan okay Joan of Arc makes a little appearance a little cameo here in the video uh we got two Ashida. that's kind of sick um we got okay we got a bunch of experience what does that mean what are you talking we're trying to tell me uh Lilith all right we got two more Imhotep um are we gonna get any more Thutmose before we run out of the first 55 and then we're gonna pop off with the mega the mega 500 key opening that's gonna be exciting I'm stoked about that we're not getting anything good here we're getting the old CPO no one cares about the old CPO it's all about the new CPO we love the Mehmed though hell yeah dude I love the Mehmed I'm very stoked about that I'm pretty close to maxing him to be honest with you Ooh, I feel like I'm getting a lot of legendaries is that just me I feel like I'm getting a lot of them I haven't I haven't maxed El Cid to be honest with you that Moses way better than El Cid I think so honestly I don't really care about him but like I don't know am I getting lucky today boys I feel like I'm getting a lot of gold key commanders that are legendaries um so we're down to our last 10 individual keys and then we're gonna pop off oh we got another summon I've got like four full summons in in like 40 or 50 keys right that's pretty sick now it's Freddy so he's garbage but that's pretty cool I haven't maxed Freddy either so like I mean that's free free sculptures for a commander that I haven't finished which is sick so hey I'll I'll take that we're gonna keep going through here uh we'll see if we can get anything spicy we got two more Emotep there anything spicy before the 500 opening we got two more and what is it gonna be boys what's it gonna be more Freddy okay no one gives a fuck. And here it is the moment that you've been waiting for the moment you clicked on this video for 500 gold keys how many Thutmos are we gonna get how many Emotep are we gonna get could we possibly get close to max and Emotep with just gold keys probably not I'm gonna get ripped off let's go ahead and pop these bad boys open yes let's use 500 golden keys oh baby let's see <sighs> I'm not gonna lie to you I actually missed what I what I got I know they flashed on the screen there but I closed my eyes because I just have no attention man so we got 368,000 experience honestly that's not that much we got 190 of the 5,000 experience so that's pretty exciting we got 131 universal speed ups which I'm 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 happy about that that's that's a that's a solid amount I mean that's free right it's free speed ups um we got some amount of resources uh guys I'm my kvk we we just basically finished King's Line, and I'm gonna be making a video about that in the next couple of days but uh, your boy is out of resources like out of resources so I could have used a lot more than that but hey it is what it is now um, the, the purple stars here these are just going to be converted into Alliance credits to be honest with you we get 72 uh golden stars we get four of the bundle of dazzling starlights and we get four of the blessed dazzling starlights okay so that's good these are very very good guys these are very good um so the fact that I only got four of them makes sense they're very rare um we get 28 individual Emotep sculptures so okay that's like two skills on him or almost uh at this point or three skills sorry I don't know somewhere in there I, I don't remember the uh, the requirements for epic upgrades because who really cares and we get three full summons okay so what is that we got uh 58 here and then I don't know how many got we got from the individual keys but let's just say we got like 68 or 70 uh Imatep sculptures from 555 gold keys somewhere in that realm there which is definitely not enough to get him very far so uh yeah that that's kind of what I expected here um we got a nice spread here we got a lot of Bjorn which is pretty good um we, we love Bjorn we got a lot of Pelagius here as well and there are the first row of the legendary commanders so we got nine we got nine Thutmose brother that's nothing we also got nine Ragnar we got 22 Mulan which I'm I'm stoked about that I like Mulan she's very good and 12 Mehmed is also very very good this bottom row these are probably the ones that I'm most interested in maybe not Ragnar maybe El said more than Ragnar but regardless um let's go ahead and scroll up here we got uh, we got more gatherers than anything else and that's pretty pretty standard I'm pretty sure the uh gold keys are rigged slightly in favor of the gathering commanders which is very unfortunate especially because the game doesn't tell you that so you have to do the math yourself but yes you're more likely to get gold key uh gathering commanders I think than any other um we got 11 El Cid which is fine 24 Martel I didn't need Martel okay I finished him already same thing with Zao Zao finished him already so that's unfortunate let's scroll up here and there it is we got a single 
we got a single Thutmo summon so we literally got what 19 here and we got maybe two from the individual opens so we got what 21 sculptures of the most from 555 gold keys that's very depressing uh and that just goes to show that's my point right my point is that by putting him in gold keys Lilith effectively just threw him in the garbage like no one's going to use him that's the thing they diluted the pool even further and old players aren't going to use universals on him because he's not that good so basically they implemented him for virtually no reason other than marketing which honestly i think it's pretty effective he's very cool i wish i could use him unfortunately i can't anyway we got one summon of ragnar one summon of mulan did we get any Mehmed? Oh, i don't think we, we got no Mehmed, dude i wanted Mehmed more than anything bro oh my god okay so we got two Ashida, two Sunduk, one Cleo, plus the two. Didn't we get like two full summons of Cleo before? I can't believe that. We got one full summon of El Cid, two full summons of Martel, which again, I don't need. We didn't get Tao Tao though, so that's good. Um, another full summon of Frederick, and we got two summons of Caesar. Honestly, this wasn't great for 555 gold keys, but we have five commanders that we can put skills on here. So let's go ahead and see uh, what those are. So let me scroll down here. Oh my God, we can put a skill on Caesar. It's been so long okay okay I wonder what skill it's gonna go into so boom there it is all right so we have a five five three five Caesar um, we are on the final two skill points for him which means uh we need 139 more sculptures and I will be finished with Julius Caesar that's a big deal all right not really he's he's trash but I do just want to finish him just because he's Caesar right like I just want him expertise okay let's see what we can do here with Mulan we've already got a five five one two Mulan and now ladies and gentlemen we have a five five one three Mulan that's actually kind of sick I actually am very happy about that I don't want this third skill so if we could just keep skipping this third skill that would be fire realistically I probably won't use her until she's expertise anyway but a five five one five uh Mulan would probably be the best configuration for Mulan before expertise so I'll take it if we can make our way there and uh it looks like we are on our way we're making our way downtown walking fast faces past more homebound so that's pretty sick all right so uh, we can add a skill to Ragnar as well which this guy is only five five one one and guys Ragnar was the newest gold key commander besides uh Thutmose. so in the last year I've only been able to get him to five five one one so just to give you guys an idea for Thutmose, a year from now you'll be lucky if he's five five one one because now that the most is in the keys the pool has diluted even further and that is a huge bummer so keep that in mind that's again just to illustrate my point of why you'll never use the most all right so we're getting more troop capacity which honestly um I think that's that's good yes okay that's what I wanted um this 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 last skill is definitely better than the third skill so we're getting lucky with our skill upgrades here today which I'm very happy about um let's see what we can do here with Emotep all right um we can so we have 79 Emotep sculptures let's go ahead and do that we're gonna see uh we can definitely finish off that first skill easy peasy lemon squeezy and bada bing bada boom we are Gucci gang uh, oh I forgot to skill lock him oh <laughs> oh my god what am I doing all right well guys <laughs> when you're upgrading uh commanders okay don't forget to skill lock him if, for me it doesn't matter because I'm about to just finish him off let's just go ahead and do it while we're here okay let's just let's just pop off while we're while we're while we're at it all right I do think he's probably uh you know top two or top three best epics in the game I talked about that in my uh, beginner's guide to rise of kingdoms which was an hour long if you're a new player go ahead and check out my brand new beginner's guide for 2022 it'll be extremely useful it'll be linked down below yes it is an hour long but the whole thing is filled with chapters uh and you could just jump exactly to the information that you need and I do talk about epic commanders in that uh, video so there it is we've unlocked the expertise for Emotep there it is dude okay let's take a look at the boy of the hour the most the third ladies and gentlemen uh we do want to we do want to skill lock this guy we absolutely want to skill lock this guy I almost messed that one up okay absolutely be careful about that but unfortunately we can only do two skill upgrades boo Lilith give me more sculptures of Thutmose okay what is this I can't even I'm not gonna be able to ever use this guy it's depressing okay very very disheartening Lilith listen okay I know I'm begging at this point but look you got this dotted line here okay just go ahead and add like 10 more expedition levels and just give us some some of the chests for for Thutmose the third okay you see this treasure of thoughts beloved okay you already put this in the game which means you already have a, a chest in the game that gives me the possibility of getting Thutmose the third okay so just go ahead put a couple of more expedition levels in here all right and just give me give me a chest that gives me the chance just give me the chance that's all I'm asking for okay I would love if I could if I could trade Ethelflaed for Thutmose that'd be amazing all right I really want to use him even though he's not great 
I can't. So all I'm asking, just, just give me something, okay? Give me something. Give me more expedition levels. Whatever it takes, whatever I got to do, I'll do it. Just I, these treasures of the warrior queen are boring these days. All right. It's basically I'd rather get gold or silver keys out of them. All right. That's it for the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, drop a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. If you're new here, click the bell to be notified the next time that I upload a Rise of Kingdoms video. And with that being said, guys, I'll talk to you later. Peace.